Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to talk about SAID organization. I, in the last two, maybe three years, have bounced from different SAID organizers, and I want to show you kind of the process that I went through and where I'm at today. I started off with this seed organizer. This is the next thing that I went to. I had a four tier box that I sprayed with chalkboard paint on the front and then on the sides I sprayed with black spray paint and I put all my seeds in here. You can see it doesn't take long and those seeds become a jumbled up mess. As I would take the seeds out of here, I would stick them into a basket and that was my planting basket. And these were all the seeds that I wanted to plant. But then when I got done with the basket, I didn't know where they went back. And so they didn't. So I had several planting baskets laying around. I really needed to come up with a plan, something big enough for everything to go back into some place that if I started to expand, then I would have more room. Also, I want to start doing more of my own seed saving. And so I needed to have a space where I could put bigger containers of seeds in. Bottom drawer pretty much was not being used for anything. This cabinet I got on Facebook Marketplace for $10. As you can see, I have lined up all of my seeds. Almost all of them. Obviously, you guys see this, this mess over here that I still need to organize. But in here, I went to the Dollar Tree and I got some of these dollar boxes because I thought these were super, super cute and it would keep these bags that I also got at the Dollar Tree. So now we have all of our leafy spring greens in this container here and they're alphabetized. Okay, so anybody can come in, should, they can easily find um, the mustard greens. Okay, mustard greens, there we go. There's some mustard greens there. But then, here's the other thing that I really like. There's enough space in here that I can have my big jar of Anasazi beans in there. That's right. I can have my big jar of Anasazi beans and I can find it easily. I don't have it laying around. It's not gonna get kicked and dumped and spilled all over the floor. It's right there. So, I also have some alfalfa seed. I keep my old mayonnaise jars. I believe this one had some chocolates in it. And uh, this is my peppers. These are some of my peppers, not all of my peppers. I have several peppers that you folks have sent to me that I want to um, grow this year. And so they are actually laying on my desk waiting for me to get them in the ground, which I need to be doing like right now. Um, so my okra, I have my beans, so here I have my spring stuff, over here I have my summer stuff, and then on this side I have my flowers. So anything um, to do with flowers or herbs I have on this side of the drawer. I have a few more seeds than the average gardener, so... I want to wish you guys a happy, healthy week, and I will see you guys in the next video. I'll talk to you later. Bye now.